state in America. But we have very little, if any, gun responsibility laws. We are here to demand justice for the cold-blooded murder of Marquise McLaughlin by the self-appointed wannabe cop, Michael Drinker. And that's what this was. Make no mistake about it. This was a cold-blooded murder that was witnessed firsthand by Brittany Jacobs and Marquise's three young children. Marquise Jr., who was five years old, Marley, his daughter, who was three years old, and Marshawn, his four-month-old baby. They all saw it firsthand, and for the rest of their lives, they're going to have to deal with this unbelievable traumatic episode of seeing their father gunned down in cold blood. This follows a long line of these alleged stand-your-ground murderers in the state of Florida. We know when we were all introduced to this stand-your-ground law with Trayvon Martin in Sanford, Florida. And then you had Corey Jones in West Palm Beach, Florida. Amen. And now you have Marquise McLaughlin here in Pinellas County, Florida, where the individual is the initial aggressor, starts the confrontation, and then kills the unarmed black person and claims it's self-defense. We have to speak truth to power. And we all know that race is a factor in this case. And just imagine if the roles were reversed and you had a black man approach a white woman sitting in the car with her two white toddler children in the back seat and the white father came out to protect his family and shot this strange black man who approached their car. Does anyone doubt that he would have been arrested and taken to jail if he would not have been shot right there in the parking lot? So why is it different when there is an unarmed black person lying on the ground dead? You raise them to be men just so they could be the protectors of their own families. Unfortunately, that's all my son was doing, protecting his family. Any man out there would have did the exact same thing. Amen. If you push a man down to the ground, that man does not deserve to be shot. Stand up and fight with your fist. You don't shoot a man because a man pushes you to the ground. Thank you.